Good morning, ladies. All right, so the, blah, blah, blah. I guess I'm just getting a little bit ahead of myself. Um, so this morning, um, we are going to do a little eyeshadow look. Um, I don't know what I was singing. It's, I guess, I'm happy. Kids are in school. It's awesome. Okay, so when we do our eyeshadow, I've already done my five minute face. Okay, I took a little bit of my highlight and I have primed my eyes. So I'm going to go in and I'm trying to find my favorite brush. Okay, right, here it is. This is the eyeshadow brush. This makes all of your eyeshadow looks super easy. Like this was a game changer for me. So, because I was like, I'm a messy eyeshadow person. I can never get like a beautiful smoky or, you know, it's hard to do. I don't know how those girls do it. But this brush, I'm like, oh, actually I do not a bad job. So, ma Mascara Saint, still getting used to the name change, has a, a lot. We have a lot of eyeshadows. Um, some are shimmer, some are matte, some are cream. Summer sparkle. Oh, the sparkles. Love it. Um, this is not all of them. I am actually, that is like one of my life goals is to get all the all the saint uh, eyeshadows. It's, yeah, I don't know if it's much of a goal, but it is for me. I really like it. Okay, so enough chatting, Lindsay. Let's get to business. I am going to start with Sabrina. I always use Sabrina or Cupcake as my, what do you call it? Like I put my highlight on as a primer. So now I need to set my primer. So I'm going to use Sabrina. It has a little bit of a shimmer. Okay. Uh, it's super pretty. And sometimes I just wear Sabrina. Like if I'm like, go to the grocery store and don't really feel like doing the whole eye look. I'll just throw a little Sabrina on because it's got a bit of a shimmer and makes your eyes pop a little bit. Okay. Now this motion I'm using is called the windshield wiper. Look at that. Okay. And when I hold my brush back like that, it gives me a little more like, you know, it's not quite as hard. If I was in here, it'd be like more precise. Okay, but this with this like um, setting, setting, what, whatever I'm doing, I'm setting my primer. I just want to sweep. I just want to sweep it on there. Okay, now next, my next favorite color I've been using a lot of is Bubba. It's kind of like that color, orangey brown, perfect for fall. And I'm going to do a high crease. So when you do high crease, you keep your eyes open and you go right above your crease line. Okay. So if we have hooded eyes, this is like, you want to do your eyeshadow looks with your eyes open. Okay. So go in with Baba. These eyeshadows are super pigmented. So you want to make sure that where you start applying the eyeshadow is where you want the most color. So it's a good idea to always start at the outside of your eye and then work in, okay? And then I'm just gonna go down here and do like this little swirly motion just to bring a little bit down onto my eyelid. And what you do to one, you gotta do to the other. So let's get over here and get it on your eyes. So I've used Sabrina and Bubba. And this has kind of been my go-to colors for the last little bit. Okay, super pretty. Now I'm gonna flip my end to the pointy end and I'm gonna grab a little bit of Finn. Finn is a darker brown. Um, you will be able to see it on here. It's, and it has a little bit of a shimmer to it. So I'm gonna just take Finn and put it on the corner outer corner of my eye and this you guys is not fancy like I'm just blobbing it on see not fancy 
blobbing it on. And we'll do the same over here. Oh, got a little bit too much. Okay, pretty even, pretty, pretty, pretty even. Okay, now I'm just gonna grab, flip the ends and I'm going to blend. Okay, I'm gonna pull that darker color into the middle and up a little bit into the bubba. So see how pretty that blended out. And I'm gonna do the same over here. Super easy. So Sabrina all over. Bubba high crease, thin outer corner. Okay, look at that. Okay, I'm just gonna grab a clean brush um, and I'm gonna go back in with my a cleaner brush and grab a little bit more Sabrina. And I'm just gonna tap it into the inner um, corner of my eye. So see that? Okay, I'll do the same to the other one just to add some lightness in that corner. Gosh, look at it. Now you could blush, you could blend that out a little bit. If you find that you've got a little bit too much on, just blend it out a little bit right there. Got it. Okay, so there, is my eyeshadow look. Three eyeshadows, Sabrina, Bubba, Finn. My favorite. Okay, now I'm gonna go in and grab that Finn color with my hotline brush. I don't know if it's still called hotline brush, but um, it's actually the eyebrow brush, but I love this angled end on it to do my eyeliner. So I just took that fin and I'm gonna do a quick eyeliner on the top. And a little down here on the bottom. Nothing too fancy. So yes, and you guys, if you have any questions about the eyeshadows, just shoot me a message or put it in the comments below. I can definitely recommend some eyeshadows for you if, if that's what you're looking for. Um, when you purchase four eyeshadows, you get this beautiful little palette, or palette, you get a beautiful palette of eyeshadow colors, whatever you picked, and um, a little compact to put them all into. So I love the compacts. I love that they're magnetic. You can pop them out. And when you purchase these eye shadows, um, you purchase them singly. So you're not buying like, I don't know, I've gone and bought like uh, Urban Decay Naked Palette and then use only like four or five colors out of it and then the others go to waste. I'm like, oh, that's a waste of money and they're super expensive. So this, you just purchase them individually and replace them as they, you know, as you, as you run out of them and you're getting what you want. You're not getting a bunch of crap that you don't want. Okay, so um, Saint does not have mascara. So just use whatever you want. Usually I'd, Oh, there it is. It's like usually I crimp my eyelashes, but here she is. Um, okay, so we don't have mascara, which was really weird when we were named mascara that we didn't have mascara, but now we don't have to answer that question anymore. It's so awesome. Um, so I use Fan Norma by Mary Kay. Um, but really like lots of girls use all the different ones like unique has like an amazing one that gives you like these 3d lashes and um sephora has a great one called better than sex i've used it before and i have just i've got a girlfriend who sells mary Kay, so i have been supporting her and 
I use Van Norma and I actually super love it. So do you, whatever you want to do. Um, okay, to finish this look, I should do my eyebrows. So back with the hotline brush. Okay, so I got my hotline brush and now we're gonna do my eyebrows. So saying I use trust, so I just go in here, grab the trust, and this hotline brush is amazing. It gives you like the perfect little hair strokes. So I'm gonna start. So when you do your eyebrows, I'm gonna try and do this for you guys. You should be starting like right where the corner of your eye is. I have to do it in this little mirror, otherwise I get like a little bit crazy and all over the place. And then I just pull up to make my eyebrows like kind of bushy in the beginning. And then if you were to take your pen, your pen, your brush, and go across the pupil, right here is where your corner should be. Okay, so you can kind of map that out. You can put a dot there or whatever you want. So there's where my corner is. And now I'm gonna start to pull down. Ah, I hope that helps you guys. Okay, and then I just brush this up. Sometimes I go in and give myself a little cheat line so that I have like some line to go off of on the bottom. And then we can just blend it all out. And you can go as bushy as you want or brush them down. Whatever blows your hair back. Okay. Now for eyebrows, you can also use your contour. Um, I'll do that in another video. It's fine. Right now, I'm just gonna use the trust because I've started it already. Okay, so back in here, just gonna give myself a little line to go off of. Pull up, 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 up. And I have one eyebrow that I love doing way better than the other. Yeah, it's funny. And remember, they're not, they're not twins, they're just sisters. So it's okay if you've got like, if they're a little bit different, you guys. We are not going to be perfect. Cause my, well, our, uh, mine are not gonna be perfect, that's for sure. Got one that the hair grows a little bit crazy on. Maybe that's from like plucking and stuff. Okay, and then just go in and peel it back in. I actually should maybe get these bad boys sugared a little bit. It might be time. Okay, and a little line underneath. Okay, eyebrows are done. And I mean, I could fiddle with them forever. So for purposes of the video, my eyebrows are done. All right, so eyes are done, eyebrows are done. This is it, you guys. Have a great day. If you have any questions, pop them in the comments. Bye.